We have an air conditioner, a little window unit running because this thing's broken. We're dealing with OG&E. And we have the fan in on in the on mode. And I noticed as I was walking through the kitchen that the kitchen was really warm. So I was like, well, I started thinking, well, is the fan on? And I couldn't hear it for, because that's where the furnace is. It's in our kitchen area. Walk to the hallway and look what I find. The thermostat has turned off again. So in the past few weeks, well, it started off, you know, turning off and then on. Basically, it would turn the air conditioner on or heat, then shut off and turn everything back on again and broke our system on the air conditioning side. Then the thermostat started turning off, not just turning off and then back on again. So I'm going to go ahead and undo. All I'm doing is taking basically power away from it and doing a reset basically. And it comes back on and we'll see. So it's back on. So, and as you can see, it came back to the on position. So when it reset, it used to reset and turn off and on, it would, whatever position it was in, it would kick right back to that right away. Well, that's bad and that's why our air conditioner is blown up and even our heat system. Also within that, this is failing out to the point of just outright shutting off. So og &E can sit and say all day long that they're not responsible because uh, uh, the fan, because uh, uh, they're saying they're not responsible because the fan motor went out. Well, there's quite a bit to that, and other stuff went out, but they are playing semantics with the word from the service contractor because the service contractor said they didn't see the thermostat go cycle while they were here, and they under underline that. Oh, Genie is saying, well, your service contractor is saying they didn't see it at all. Well, no, it didn't happen while they were here, but it's on video, and, and not only that, OG &E is paid for service contractors tw twice now and even when og &E service contractor came out last year and replaced the capacitor for the fan motor that is out now out so obviously that was tied together then they the defrost board they said had to be replaced so og &E was going to do that this time around which they didn't do and so uh sorry my verbiage is a little bit off i'm I was in the middle of other stuff when i had to start filming for this and you know think about this so i'm still thinking about something more important no not more important than this but just as important but long version short is if you have an og smart thermostat and it breaks your shit you need to document everything because og is going to do everything they can to get out of it